So, you've gone and got yourself a brand new Canon Pixma Home MG3660. Good choice. Let's get it up and running. Take care to cut through the packaging tape with a suitable knife or a pair of scissors. Open the box like so. Lift out these important bits and pieces. Keep them to one side for now as we'll need them later. And then slide out the printer. Remove the polystyrene packaging wraps then take the printer out of the bag. All the orange bits of tape and plastic can then be removed and recycled or discarded. Before you do that, make sure you're not throwing away anything that you'll need, such as the ink cartridges, cables, installation discs and these bits of paper. Locate the power socket and plug in the cable like this. Make sure the wall outlet switch is off before plugging the other end into the wall. If you're going to be connecting the printer with a USB cable, don't plug it in just yet. You'll be prompted to do this when you install the software. Now, go ahead and switch on the power. Now, it's time to put the ink cartridges into the printer. Open the front cover like so. Wait until the printhead carriage swings into place. In no particular order, you can remove the ink tanks from their wrappers and place them into their corresponding slots. Make sure you remove the tank outlet seal first. Each ink tank will fit into place with a discernible click. When you're all done, close up the printer. You'll then hear the printer making a few noises while it gets the printer ready for action. Open up the paper tray at the front of the printer and place in a few sheets of paper, making sure that the paper guides are set to the right position. That brings us to the end of the initial setup phase. You can now go ahead and connect your smartphones, tablets and computers.